What's going on? It's James here. I'm back again to connect people, properties, and possibilities. So July 2017 just ended. So I wanted to compare for you what happened in LA County in July 2017 compared to the July in 2016. Again, I'm giving you a big overview picture of what went on in July for the entire county of Los Angeles so you can get a bigger picture of what's going on. And when we sit down together, you know, real estate is local. So we'll focus on your specific area that you're interested in when we sit down together. Well, let's get started. So we can see here in July 2016, we had almost 20,000 active listings in 2016 July. But this year, we only had about a well, little bit over 16,000, close to 17,000 uh, active listings in July. So that is down by 14.6%. Now, how many active listings? It doesn't really matter so much until you really see how many listings actually sold. So last year in July 2016, we had about close to 6,000 homes that sold. And this year, we had only about 5,317 homes that sold. So uh, it's almost 6,000. This is closer to 5,000. So that is down 10.8% for sold listings in 2017 compared to 2016. And then the average days on the market, you're still looking at uh, less time in the market. So as you can see, there's less homes for sale and there are less homes being sold, but then it's still going off the market just as fast. Uh, instead of 53 days, average days on the market, you're looking at 31 days. Just about a day over one month, or exactly one month, depending on which month you're looking at, of course. So that is down by 41.5%. Uh, wow. And the most important thing you probably wanna know is what's going on with the sale price, right? Because that's what really matters, how much money you're putting on the table to buy that home. And here we're looking at an increase in the average sales price. So that's an increase of 10.7%. There you have it. So that's what's going on in LA County this year in July compared to last year in July. You're having less homes being available for sale. And then there's a little bit less homes actually being sold. And they're not on the market as long anymore. They're flying off the market still at 31 days and the price has increased. So what does this mean for you? All right, so what you're seeing here in July, maybe the market's slowing down, summer season's over, people are starting to focus more on going to school, people who needed to buy a home have already bought their home, springtime already, beginning of summer. What's important is the prices, they're still increasing, right? So if you're buying, you're still gonna be looking at multiple offers and prices going up. And if you're looking to sell, it's still just as important to market your home the right way and to generate maximum demand for your home so you can get top dollar for that home. Anyway, if you have any questions about your specific neighborhood or areas you're looking into, feel free to private message me. You know how to get a hold of me already. You take care and have a damn good day. This is an update for LA County for July 2017 compared to July 2016. Hope you found this nugget useful for you. All right. Take care. Bye-bye.